Good afternoon and welcome to the Xavier University of Louisiana Convocation Center. I'm Zora Thomas, your broadcaster today. And today we're getting to watch the Xavier Gold Nuggets face off against the Paul Quinn Tigers. The Gold Nuggets are coming in with the record of 13 and 4. Paul Quinn Tigers are 5 and 10. Today we're getting ready to call up the lineups. Paul Quinn are only going to have six players today with only one reserve player. The one reserve is going to be number two. And I, McPherson, getting ready to do the national anthem before we kick off our game for today. It's going to be an interesting matchup to see how the Paul Quinn Tigers are just going to be able to sustain all four quarters playing against the Gold Nuggets. Your starting five today, Shyla McGee is on an active streak right now, having eight games, making two or more three-pointers. Definitely been hot here, especially with the last home game they played here on Thursday against Southwest. Xavier also right now in NAIA stat ranking is third in three-point field percentage defense at .236, also fourth in field goal percentage at defense, and fourth in NAIA with 13.9 steals per game. Xavier is leading this series 21-0. Last season, both of the meetings that they had against the Paul Quinn Tigers were actually forfeit victories. But the last time that they met up was in Dallas, Texas on December 2nd of 2023. Xavier would end up winning the game 61 to 50 with Mary Wilkins being their leading scorer with 13 points. Zaria Harlow getting ready to start off the tip off. Ball going out of bounds. Goes in possession of the Gold Nuggets. Jayla Williams on the floor. 
aggressive defense. She was playing last Thursday, applying great pressure on Paul Quinn, resulting in a number of turnovers for them to convert. Charlie McGee starts off with air ball to three. Trying to continue that streak we talked about earlier with two to three three-pointers per game. Points, Harlow. Harlow is able to connect, get that first point on the board for the, for the Gold Nuggets. Jayla Williams hustling back and forth between two Tigers. Ball gets knocked Steal away. Shylin McGee is able to get the steal. Going inside to Harlow, who goes up for two. Back-to-back two -back scores for Harlow. Trying to drive inside. Kayla Webster not able to get it. Manning. Has to stop going inside to Taylor DeWay, who goes up against two Tiger defenders, able to get her own rebound. McGee trying to get around. Three-pointer taken by Manning off the rim. Rebounded by number 11, Sydney Bowen. McGee goes inside, faces some contact, is still able to get the score. Almost left open, Bowen. Tiger trying to find a way to stay open. Tries to go up, gets fouled. Correction, travel called. Ball goes back, Gold Nuggets. Going to Taylor DeWitt, shoots from the free throw line, banks it in. Webster trying to get around, ball gets knocked away. Another travel called. Williams go, trying to go inside to do it. Called out of bounds. Another possession going back into the hands of the Gold Nuggets. Tigers. McGee gets blocked by number 10, Marquise Nelson. Four seconds on the clock, has to take a three. Jordan Manning for three. Knocked away, Harlow. Goes up for two, gets fouled. Tigers already have four turnovers. 
seven of 11 of the Golden Nuggets points have been off of those turnovers. Able to inbound it to to Lofton. Trying to apply pressure again in that backcourt. Number 23, Lofton was wide open on the inside. Williams didn't see our teammate. Tigers have yet to still put some points on the board. Seven seconds on the shot clock. Can't get around. Three, has to take a shot. Able to get the rebound, Nelson goes back outside to Webster. Tries to get around Harlow. Paul Quinn manages to get their first points on the board. Webster. Trying to go for a three-point play here. And she gets it. Gold Nuggets still up by 10, score 13 to three. Almost took the whole first half of the first quarter for the, for the Tigers to put some points on the board. McGee shooting for three. Off the rim, Headquist trying to get the rebound. Goes off her hands, going back to the Tigers. Sydney Bowen. Gives it back to Webster. Williams applying pressure, trying to stay tight. Williams get called on the play. McPherson tries to go up for the shot, able to go to the line to shoot for two. Jaleel Lafargue and Raina Ross now checking in for the Gold Nuggets. Again, one of the most notable things the Gold Nuggets are going to have for them this game is the amount of subs that they have on their roster. Paul Quinn only had six players for their squad this afternoon. Goes in, Patricia Sosa Laura, and now sister of Jayla Williams, Jada Williams, now checking in. Raina Ross goes inside. Sosa Laura gets knocked away by Webster. Jump ball gets called. Got back out to the corner, shoots for three. High arc able to get the rebound, Nelson. Shooting again for three. Not able to get it. Goes in the hands of Raina Ross. Sierra Headquest trying to go inside it. Headquist has Williams open. Raina Ross shoots for three. Off the rim. Tigers trying to close the gap. Now down by eight. 
Good pass going back outside to Lofton. Shooting for three. Off the rim again. Headquist knocks it away and goes back to the Tigers. So, so Laura tries to go in for a block, gets caught on the foul. Coach Bo Browder now subbing all five players. So now Zaria Harlow, Jayla Williams, Shyla McGee, Taylor DeWitt, and now Jordan Manning back in. Bounces in. Marquise Nelson is shooting for the Lady Tigers. Nelson, the 5'11 senior from San Jose, California, at the line. Goes one for two. Manning going inside of Taylor DeWitt. Travel gets called. Part of Sydney Bowen's knee brace came off. Golden Nuggets trying to stay tight in the backcourt. Harlow playing tight D on Willie. On Lofton, still able to get through. Tries to cross over, goes up with the layup. Not able to get there. McGee with another rebound. Trying to drive inside. Stops just short. Tries to go inside. Taylor DeWitt who pulls up for two. Ah. Foul gets called on Zaria Harlow. She tries to get the rebound. Tigers are taking a timeout. Even with the smaller roster. Definitely a lot of energy here in this first quarter. And again, we'll see how the next three quarters are gonna go. Just down by seven, score 13 to six. Inbounded by the Tigers. Williams trying to stay tight on McPherson. Lofton tries to drive inside past two gold nuggets. Not able to get there. Manning goes up. Not able to put it through. Taylor DeWitt gets called on the travel. Goes back over to the, to the Tigers. Golden Nuggets have to get 
those easy two-pointers, especially if they're able to get opportunities like that. Harlow has to go inside, puts it up. Not able to put it down. Goes up again, ball gets knocked away, going back over to the Tigers. Jump ball gets called. Tigers definitely fighting for every point, every ball. Charlotte McGee for three. Rolls out. Less than two minutes to go, passing it over to Bowen, who shoots for two. Bounces off the rim, trying to get the rebound, goes back into the hands of the Tigers and able to get it out. Knocked away, Shiloh McGee gets blocked by Nelson. Julia Lafargue now checking in. Kyla Cage now coming in for Jordan Manning. Inbound to Lafarg. Taylor DeWitt trying to push her way inside. Goes back out to McGee who shoots for three. Banks it in. First three of the afternoon for McGee. Less than a minute to go. Throws it up. Off the rim, tries to get her own rebound, goes in the hands of Williams, who drives past, lays it up, too strong, rebounded by two Gold Nuggets who lose the ball. Goes back to the Gold Nuggets, knocked Mary away by Williams Tigers. Mary Wilkins now checking in. Wilkins goes inside of Taylor DeWitt, tries to fight inside, able to push it in. Gold Nuggets up by 12. Bowen almost left open, tried to drive inside and fakes. McPherson tries to drive inside, gets her own ball back. Wanted a travel called. Mary Wilkins not able to put it in for the Gold Nuggets. Now the Tigers have an opportunity to score in the last five seconds of this quarter. Drives up, tries to do the right-handed layup, not able to get there. Into the first quarter, score 18 to six. Gold Nuggets up. Daria Harlow leading the Gold Nuggets with six points right now and two rebounds, followed by Shiloh McGee with five points, going two for eight right now.
the Tigers are going to open up the second quarter with the possession. Trying to stay tight on McPherson right now. Jalila Fogg defending her. Able to get an opportunity to shoot for three. Long three. Banks it in. Alora Lofton, the 5'8 senior from Orlando, Florida. Ross passes it over to Mary Wilkins. Cage tries to go inside to Taylor DeWitt, almost loses the ball. Tries to fight inside, met by three Tigers, throws it away. Number 44, Patricia Sosalora, 6'2", junior from Santo Domingo, Dominican Republic, now checking in. Getting past, pulls up for two, gets fouled and one. Alora Lofton again. Paul Quinn ended the first quarter shooting under 10%, shooting at 6.7. Gold Nuggets ended almost shooting at 30% in that first quarter. Paul Quinn definitely waking up more with their defense, able to find opportunities to stop the Gold Nuggets from scoring. Raina Ross able to get the rebound. Knocked away, gets into the hands of Marquise Nelson. Shooting again, a long three. Banks in for Sydney Bowen. Paul Quinn now trying to close the gap within four, score 18 to 14. Ross trying to drive, pulls up for two with the spin. Misses the mark. Nelson able to get another rebound. Shooting again for three off the rim. Sosa Laura is able to get the rebound. Lafarge tries to cross pass Webster. Goes up again for two, not able to put it in. Sosa Laura fighting to get inside and gets fouled by Nelson. The Gold Nuggets have to get those two points when they're inside, especially when they have perfect openings. Been going a little too strong sometimes with their layups. Missing those easy points. Sosalora now shooting for two. First one bounces out. Second one goes in. Xavier up by five. Pulls up for two, Sierra Hadquist tries to get the rebound. Able to get the ball back. Lafarge left open, tries to cross pass. Has to go to the corner to Williams, who shoots for three. Gets it stuck right in the rim.
Far getting bounced. So Solora pulls up for two. Bounces out. Ross trying to get the rebound. Jump ball. Gets caught on the jump ball. Marquise Nelson checking back in, has three rebounds right now for Paul Quinn. Going to the corner. Bowen trying to get past Lafargue. Rainer Ross now defending Webster, who pulls back for two. Good shot, taking bounces out. Goes to the corner, Sierra Headquist trying to shoot for three. Bangs it in. Sosa Laura able to get the steal. Paul Quinn not watching where the teammates are going. Sosa Laura trying to go inside, loses the ball. Webster hanging on for the jump ball. Ref talking to Webster and Sosa Laura. Sorry, I'm hard on the court now. Harlow now checking in for Sosa Laura. Sierra Headquist. Williams goes to the corner, left open. Goes back out to Ross. Goes to the corner for Lafargue. Defended. Almost losing it. Harlow is able to go up for two and get fouled. Foul on Sydney Bowen. Her first team second. Zarya Harlow at the line. Going two for two. Webster. Getting double teamed right now. Left open to McPherson. Webster trying to go under. Gets blocked by Sierra Headquist. Jordan and Manny now checking in. Golden Egg is now up by 10. Webster drives inside, lays it up, gets two. So your head close, pump fakes. Goes over to Harlow, goes back out to the corner to Manning. Manning now coming back in for the Gold Nuggets. Excuse me, Taylor DeWitt. Ball almost gets knocked away. Webster tries to go inside the loft and read by Taylor DeWitt who knocks it away. Tiger trying to get open. 
gets the steal. Jordan Manning driving inside, pulls up for two. Too strong, loses the ball. Two gold nuggets fall to the ground. Manning gets her own rebound, points, able to put it back in. Strong pass going to, Mc, going to McPherson. Goes inside to Nelson, gets it knocked away again, turned over. Goes inside to Taylor DeWitt. Goes back outside to Manning. Pulls up for two. Banks it in. Taylor DeWitt with another two. Makes it six points for her. This app. Jordan Manning, excuse me, now has seven points going into this afternoon. It's the timeout gets taken. Paul Quinn inbounds the ball. Bowen getting double teamed, goes inside to Webster, almost left open inside the paint. Goes inside, Nelson able to convert two for Paul Quinn. Lafargue tries to go up for the block, able to get the possession back. Manning going for three, off the rim. Lofton getting the rebound, almost lo loses the ball, and gets back into the hands of Zaria Harlow. Harlow trying to go around, goes up for two, not able to get it. Goes off the hand of Paul Quinn, going back to the Gold Nuggets. Jordan Manning falling to the ground, holding her right ankle. Trainers now coming onto the floor to help Manning up. Jordan Manning now going over the table to get checked out by the trainers. Shylan B.E. now coming in. Harlow pulls up for two. Doesn't get it in, gets it rebounded by Bowen. Lofton trying to get past Williams. Williams staying tight on her. She's trying to drive inside, has to pass it over. Not able to get through, has to pull back. Almost gets blocked. Tough defense by number 30, Jada Williams. Laura Lofton gets the shoot now for two. Jayla Williams checking in. Gold Nuggets up by 10 with a score 28 to 18. Shot missed by Lofton. Far getting the rebound. Taylor DeWitt fighting to get inside. Gets called on another travel. Williams coming to apply pressure. 
on Bowen. Ball almost gets. Arlo trying to chase that. Gets crossed over by Webster, who pulls up for two. Goes off the hands of the Gold Nuggets, going back to the Tigers. Pulling up for three. Banks it in. Number two, Kenai McPherson. Williams driving inside, tries to get past. Lofton. Shot taken by the Tigers. Webster limping a little bit, trying to get back on defense as she collided with Williams. McPherson trying to get past. Stop, spins around, pulls up for two. Not able to get there. Julie Lafargue is able to get the rebound. Off the hands of Shiloh McGee. Sierra Headquist now checking in. Paul Quinn now within six. Bowen going outside to McPherson, who shoots again for three. Rolls out. McGee is able to get the rebound. McGee going inside. Double teamed, loses the ball. Williams is able to Taylor get the steal. Gets steal. Taylor DeWitt goes up, gets fouled. Forty seconds to go in this first half. Paul Quinn definitely playing up. Now increase their field goal percentage to 24%, and now Xavier's gone down to 25. Xavier is now 10 of 40, and Paul Quinn is 7 of 29. Both teams having three three-pointers, shooting at 30% from the line. Shot bounces out. Bowen goes over to Lofton. Trying to find someone open. Gets double teamed. Williams. Second violation on the Lady Tigers. Ball goes back over to the Gold Knights with the violation called. Shiloh McGee drives inside and gets two. Less than 10 to go. Bowen has last scoring attempt. Ball gets knocked away by Shiloh McGee. 1.8 to go. Time winds down. 
Gold Nuggets in the half, being up by nine, score 31 to 22. Zarya Harlow is leading the team, eight for eight, shooting at four for four at, from the line. Shailen Bee and Jordan Manning both have seven points in their name. And on the other side of Paul Quinn, Alora Lofton has six points with five rebounds. Nye McPherson has five points with three rebounds, going for one for three with her three-pointers this afternoon. Be more ba back with more basketball in 15 minutes.
starting off the second half. Paul Quinn is going to start with the possession. Kyler Webster is going to inbound it. Williams already starting off strong with some tight defense against McPherson. Foul called against Zaria Harlow as Nelson on Paul Quinn gets knocked over. Zaria Harlow, her third team first. That'll be Harlow's third foul for this afternoon. Lays it up, tries to put back her own way. McPherson, Williams is able to get the rebound. Shyla McGee tries to go around, gets knocked away by Lofton. Manning is back in the game. Nuggets are going to inbound. Manning left open again. Too high of a pass, going over. McPherson chases it down, goes up and gets blocked by Williams. Ball goes back to the Gold Nuggets. Nice on Jayla Williams not to give up on that play after they lost possession. Clark pulls up for two, gets her own rebound, goes back up again, gets it in this time. Webster, Lofton shooting for three. Williams is able to get the rebound. Shiloh McGee. Trying to get around Lofton. Lofton playing some tight defense right now. Goes over the head of Webster to get it over to Taylor DeWitt. McGee for three and banks it. Gold Nuggets now up by 14. That's their largest lead since the beginning of the first quarter when they were up by 13. Travel gets called. McGee shooting for three again. Too strong, bouncing off the back of the rim. Losing the ball, Webster trying to get past Williams. Right-handed layup gets him two. Head coach Camille Smith talking to the refs, watching the calls. Lafar going inside, pulls up for two. DeWitt is able to get the rebound, goes up, gets called for a third travel on her this afternoon, trying to go inside. Oh, 
Going inside to Webster, trying to get around Taylor DeWitt. Pulls back out. McPherson shooting for three. Banks it. Manning left open, shoots for three. Too strong, bounces back into the hands of Lofton. Gets knocked away, Manning. Ball goes back to the Tigers. Now checking in. Williams now coming in. 5'9 sophomore from Arizona. Trying to get open. Lofton able to create some space. Five seconds on the shot clock. Has to shoot for three. Too strong. Going over to Shiloh, he tries to go around Lofton. Gets fouled. Banks went in. McGee, two for two at the line. Rana Ross now checking in for the Golden Nuggets. Back in. Kayla Webster checking in for the Lady Tigers. McPherson trying to get past Williams, flying by. Webster loses a hand on the ball. Lafar driving. Goes up for the right-handed layup. Misses it. Gets back into the hands of Webster and gets fouled. Sydney Bowen. Extremely shocked at the foul. Shot goes in for Taylor DeWitt. Webster trying to get past Taylor DeWitt. Sydney Bowen left open, shoots for three. McPherson able to get the rebound for the Tigers. Tries to cross past Taylor DeWitt. Gets past her, but loses the ball. Webster shooting for three. Lafargue with the rebound. Goes down low to Shyla McGee. Goes up for two. Goes back into the hands of Lofton. Pearson. Pumps the brakes. Goes over to Lofton, who shoots for three. Banks it in. Clean three-pointer. Paul Quinn now back within 10. McGee goes around 
puts up two. Webster goes down low. Ball bounces right out for Sydney Boehm. Julie Lafargue pulls up for two. Great shot. Coach Smith of the Lady Tigers now taking a timeout. Alora Lofton going to inbound for the Tigers. In the hands of McPherson. Tigers facing off very well against this Gold Nugget team today. Blocking foul called on Jayla Williams. McPherson crosses past Williams, fakes, lays it up with the right hand, not able to put it through. Taylor DeWitt gets caught on the foul. Her first team now has three. Lofton. Almost going back court, McPherson. Ball gets knocked away by McGee against Bowen. Lofton. Goes outside to Williams. Goes up top, back to Bowen. Shoots a long three with two seconds on the clock. Goes down low to Raina Ross, goes up for two. Some contact on the last shot. Coach Smith talking to the ref, not happy about the call. Going over to Raina Ross who gets the steal. Goes right back over to Bowen. Excuse me, to Kyla Webster who's able to get the steal. Shoot for three, left open. McPherson pushing back up top. A lot of contact these last couple possessions. Taylor DeWitt going inside. Gets called on another travel. Gold Nugget bench not happy. Sierra 
Your referees this afternoon, Ruben McDowell, Lynn Roberts, and Jared Waller. Foul gets caught on Williams. Jada Williams now checking in for her sister Jayla. McPherson gets possession. Long three off the backboard. Shiloh McGee goes back over to Jada Williams, goes inside to Raina Ross, gets called on the travel. Taking early steps, Corp pulling up for two. Shooting for three, rolls off. Headquist able to get the rebound. Lafargue passes it over to McGee. Gets fouled and one. Kayla Webster coming back in for the Tigers. After the first quarter, quarters two and three are definitely more evenly matched with the Gold Nuggets and the Tigers. The Tigers were shooting at the end of the half with 24% to the Gold Nuggets 27%. Going out to Bowen. Goes inside to Webster. McPherson. Lofton shooting for three. Lafargue is able to get the rebound. Pulls up for two. Rolls out off the backboard. Shiloh McGee is able to get it before going out of bounds. Passing it over to Raina Ross. Headquist pulls up for two and banks it in. Largest lead of the game for the Gold Nuggets up by 21 with a score of 51 to 30. Less than one minute to go before we go to the fourth and final quarter of this match. Lofton goes in between her legs, gets stripped away by Jada Williams. Jada Williams going up for two, not able to get it through. McPherson is able to get the rebound, driving back on her own possession. Tried to go down low to a teammate, wasn't there. Ball gets turned over, back up to the Gold Nuggets. Hedquist getting defended by Nelson. Ross going back out to McGee. Pulls. Ross trying to fight to get inside, gets stopped by Nelson, stares her down. McPherson. Pulls up, rolls as the time rolls down. End of the third end quarter. Of the third quarter. 30. Gold Nuggets, 51. Gold Nuggets up by 21 as they go into this fourth quarter.
Ball inbounded. Golden Nugget's going to start the possession of the fourth quarter. Raina Ross left open, goes back to LaFargo, shoots for three. Rolls out. Ross going out of bounds. It's both her and Jada Williams try to chase on the ball. McPherson tries to go inside, loses the ball, gets back in the hand of Lafargue. Driving, passes inside to Raina Ross, who pulls up for two. Two points, Raina Ross. Banks it in. Four points for Raina Ross this afternoon. Three point taken. Sierra Headquist with the rebound. Sierra Headquist left open. In the corner, Raina Ross open for three. Ball gets knocked away by Lofton going back over to the Gold Nuggets. Layla Sigur and Jordan Manning now checking back into this game. Sierra Headquist going inside, gets stopped. Ball going off the backboard, going out of bounds. Going back over to Paul Quinn. End of the third quarter, Shyla McGee is now leading her team with 17 points, going six of 16 from the field. Trying to go inside. Nelson tries to spin around Headquist, not able to get there. Immediate rebound by Headquist. Lafargue off her foot. Sigur now diving to the floor, fighting against Lofton. Jump ball, Jump ball gets called. Maya Johnson now checking in. Tight defense. Sigur trying to stay on Bowen. Crosses past her. Williams pushes over Bowen. Bowen not happy with no call. Spins under the net for Webster. Not able to get it. Gets her own rebound. Puts it back up and rolls it in. Two points. Sigur getting, gets called on the travel. Gold Nuggets bench not happy. Nuggets got to get ready back on defense. Up by 21. Ball going inside. Sierra Headquist trying to stay tight on Nelson. It goes up again. Sigur is able to get a rebound. Jada Williams able to get the rebound. Sigur almost loses the ball. Gets it up and puts in two. Good recovery for Sigur. Hitting the shot clock, going back over to the Gold Nuggets. Kaya Williams checking in. Sophomore Williams now checking back in. Amaya Johnson with the rock. Shooting for two, Sigur not able to get it. Batted off by the Tigers.
Patricia Sosa Laura now coming back in. In for the gold nuggets. Sagir open in the corner, tries to shoot for three. Johnson able to get the rebound, puts it back up for two, bounces out, and Williams is able to get the rebound. Webster tries to cross past Sagir, goes again, stops, and slides and gets called on the travel. Williams inbounding it to Johnson. Sigurd pulling up for three. Bounces out and Sosa Laura gets the rebound but gets called on the foul. Ball gets knocked away. Williams able to get the steal. Quick hands by Williams. Manning tries to spin around. Lofton defending tightly. Sosa Laura tries to put it back up. Sosa Laura fighting to get inside again and now gets fouled. Kayla Webster with her first foul. Shot goes in. Gold Nuggets up by 24. Two for two for Sosa Laura. Inbounded McPherson getting chased down by Johnson. Goes inside to Williams who almost loses the ball. Now getting double teamed, goes back out. Long three off the rim. Jada Williams Jada able Williams to get the rebound. Almost loses it. Still fighting to get inside and gets fouled. Fouling Kayla Webster, her second, team second. Jada Williams. Ball gets knocked away by McPherson. Gets back into the hands of Bowen. Two points for McPherson. She now has 10 points for her team. Amaya Johnson tries to get past McPherson. Almost gets knocked away. Layla Sigurd now with the ball. Passing it over to Sosa Laura who fights inside and gets fouled. Gets to go back to the line and shoot for two. Number 15, Yara Buharb, now checking in. Shot rolls in for Sosa Laura. McPherson able to get the rebound. Going over to Bowen, who shoots for three off the mark. Jordan Manning get with the rebound. Buharb getting double teamed. Left open, Johnson shooting for three. Not able to connect. Rebound by Williams. Bowen trying to get around Sosa Laura. High floater. Rebound, Patricia Sosa Laura. Johnson left open again. She passes it back up to the top to Yarbuhar, who goes inside to Sosa Laura, pushes inside for two, and gets it in. So Salora now with six.
McPherson pulls up for two, not able to connect. Manning almost loses the ball, gets it back, gets knocked away by Lofton. Kyla Cage. Kyla Cage checking in. McPherson going to the corner of Bowen, trying to get past Johnson, fights her way up and gets caught on the foul. Johnson with her oh, first. Second shot goes out. Layla Sigur. Foul gets called on Kyla Cage, knocking into Nelson. McPherson stuck in a corner right now. Trying to get around, stops, goes out to Lofton and pulls up for three. Rebounded by Nelson. Ball goes back over to Tigers. Often with the possession. Pulls up for two. Bounces out, Sosa Laura with a rebound. Gets fouled by Nelson. A lot of rebounds today, but Xavier has 62 total rebounds. Number 23, Gabrielle Morrison, 5'5", sophomore guard from Tampa, Florida. Bowen going out to Lofton, getting guarded by Buharb. Lofton trying to get around, goes up for two and gets fouled on the inside. Foul on Kyla Page, her second team has four. Lofton now getting Laura at the Lofton line to shoot. The line for the Lady Tigers. Less than two minutes to go here in this game. Gold Nuggets up by 27, score of 62 to 35. Shot bounces out. Goes off the hands of number 22, Williams. Loses the ball off the rebound. Yara Buhar pulls up for two. Banks it in.
Bowen trying to go inside. No one there. Goes over to the hands of Kyla Cage. Yara Buharb going inside to Patricia Sosalora who Patricia lays it in. Crossed over by Lofton. Goes inside to Nelson. Amaya Johnson trying to get it back. And loses it. Goes back over to the Tigers. Gold Nuggets bench fired up by the soft layup by Patricia Sosalora. Left open, McPherson shooting for three. Rolls out, Yarbuhar with the rebound. 45 seconds to go here in this match. Gold Nuggets up by 30. Three pointer taken by Morrison going off the side of the backboard. Ball goes over to the Tigers. Gold Nuggets are going to get this win at home. Less than 30 to go. With the Gold Nuggets looking to win this game, Lofton with the late pass missing. With the Gold Nuggets winning this game, it'll be their longest win streak of three games since winning seven in a row at the beginning of this season. This will be 24 of the last 27 home games that they're going to be winning. Running the clock out. Xavier is going to win this match 66 to 36 here at the Convocation Center. Shyla McGee was leading the team with 17 points, going 6 of 16 and 2 for 7, shooting for 3. She had 8 rebounds and 2 assists. Patricia Sosalora would be the next leading scorer with 10 points, having nine rebounds, and shooting six of eight at the line this afternoon, followed by Zarya Harlow, who was four for four at the line and had eight points. Both, Ken both Kenai McPherson and Laura Lofton had 10 points for the Paul Quinn Tigers. Getting ready to start off this next matchup, our men's gold rush are looking to come on the court to also play against the men's Tigers. Xavier would end up out shooting, of course, in this game with 31% to Paul Quinn's 19%. Both teams were shooting around the same of 21% to Paul Quinn's 17%, shooting three-pointers. At the line, Xavier was much more successful this afternoon, shooting at 84%. Paul Quinn getting almost 60, shooting at 58. Xavier also had almost half of their points off of turnovers. They had 31 points from the mistakes of Paul Quinn. We'll be back in 15 minutes with more basketball from the men's 